Okay. Alright, so I'm doing my mom's spinach dip. I'm doing this crock pot right here. So what it is, you need two bags of like frozen spinach, spinach or um you can get canned, you can get fresh, whatever. Uh this goes into the bag, it goes over there, it goes over there, over here. And you need um so yeah, we open this stuff. And you need a whole onion, half a brick of the Velveeta cheese, and I'm also putting some cream cheese in, like a half a brick, and some garlic uh, in there. So I'm going to get this open. I'm going to put right behind me. This is not really uh, hard to do. Just pour that in here. Where's the other one? <coughs> All right, so I'm doing this. And like that. Just make sure you break them up a little bit too. And make sure your hands are clean But when you're doing this. I did. I'm letting them know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. It's got a thicker butt. Oh, Probably shush. Will. Put my onion in. These guys are nuts. And I'm putting half of my cream cheese in. I need a spoon. Can you give me a spoon, please? Thank you. This is a knife that I just put away. The only thing I, oh, the scissors is the only thing you put away. No knife. Okay. Now, this and this. This, all, this and this. This can go in here. I'm going to grab a knife so I can kind of chop this up a bit. I don't really have to slice this, but I'm doing it just to get it in there. And when it softens up, I'll come back and I'll show you like the, uh, you know, the seasonings I put in. I put a few seasonings in there too. I um, Thanksgiving I didn't put cream cheese in it, but this time I'm gonna. Come on, get off. Thank you. So that's garbage. Let's see. Okay, so one. Do like a half of a second one. I don't want it too garlicky. We'll leave that in there because we use this. All right, so I'm gonna put it, plug her in. If I can get my lid back on. What the hell? All right. Spread this out a little bit. And I'll come around and stir it every little bit just to get it to work. Where'd my lid go? Oh, here it is. All right, there's the lid. Plug her in. I'm gonna put it on one. This is an old fashioned one. Let it cook for a couple hours. Yeah, so put it on two. All right, so let that cook. I'll come back and I'll stir it up and everything when it gets like melty. And I'll stir it up and everything. So we'll be back. By an hour. Yeah, probably. Or two. Bye. Oh, we sent an egg also too. That's what the instructions said. I'll wait till it melts down. I'll put the egg in. Okay, I stirred it up. So I gotta add the breadcrumbs, and I gotta get the book. So I'm supposed to add something else to it. Oh, you can see. Hmm. So I'm adding some of the breadcrumbs. Let me get my book. Hold on. Okay, so now I'm going to add the two eggs. Eggs are in there. Then I'm going to add the rest of this. So that's the cilantro. I'm going to add the rest of that. Try to add as much as I can. Alright, that's good. Still been trying to get rid of this container. A little bit of original Danos. Not a lot. And then I'm going to add some onion powder. Okay. Now I'm going to mix it up. Oh, can you hand me salt and pepper? Run away. 
this? Is this done? That's I haven't cooked it yet. It only takes. No, but is it done? Yes. I'm putting salt and pepper in here. Okay, now I'm gonna let this cook on low. I had to turn that sucker on. Alright. Here we go. What's the on uh Okay, this is done. So I put it on low. That's what it looks like, and it tastes really good. Ooh, it's foggy. <laughs> Come on, thing. And it tastes really good, so. Alright, I'll see you guys in the next one.